guys, we spend a lot of time talking about new updates, what anticipated from the startup visa program and work permit uh, processing, but we're still not sure about what to expect in terms of practical steps. And we try to, not to speculate, but apply our educated guess, if you like, in terms of what can we expect from the government and what is hidden from the public view. I mean, do, do you think we have something to cover right now? Do we have some uh, warning sign? Um, first of all, I would say that for now it's just our guesses as the government still did not post any official guidelines. Uh, they promised to post it later on this year, so we will keep you updated. But uh, the biggest question what could arise and um, about proof of funds, right? Uh, before, as you all know, um, in order to apply for work permit, essential members were supposed to maintain funds, which are higher than for non-essential members. Right now, since the government has given an opportunity for non-essential members to apply for uh, open work permit, there is a question, would funds will be required as for essential members? Or would funds would not be required at all, considering that they will have an opportunity to obtain employment in Canada? This is a big question mark. Which leads me to another question. Will there be essential member at all? Like, will there be demolition of essential, non-essential designation? That may be coming, so follow us. That's exactly the point we need to make for you guys. We try to work for you the best way possible, try to dig information, bits and pieces, connect it together and inform you, our clients and those who would like to share this information with you. Subscribe, follow and you will be safe.